The M142 High Mobility Artillery Rocket System Hammers is a light multiple rocket launcher developed in the late 1990s for the United States Army and mounted on a standard U.S. Army M1140 truck frame. Built by military contractor Lockheed Martin, High Mobility Artillery Rocket System can fire the same type of long-range ordnance as a conventional multiple launch rocket system MLRS, such as the M270. The Himmers is interoperable with the latest precision munitions ranging from 9 miles to 310 miles. This includes the entire multiple launch rocket system or MLRS munitions suite, such as the extended range guided MLRS, GMLRS, precision strike missile or PRSM, and Army tactical missile system. The existing standard guided multiple launch rocket system rocket has a range of 43 miles, but a new extended range variant can travel more than twice as far. The modern, large diameter Army tactical missile system, on the other hand, can travel to a maximum range of 186 miles. And the new, lighter precision strike missile, which is set to enter service in 2023, can boost up to a maximum range of 310 miles. Although Himmers can fire the same munitions as MLRS launchers, it has one key difference a wheeled chassis rather than tracks. This design provides a one-of-a-kind shoot and scoot capability, allowing soldiers, Marines, and forces allies to position, engage, and quickly relocate after firing. Furthermore, because the future battlefield is unpredictable, adaptability is becoming increasingly important that it requires to bring the fight to a previously unreachable location. But no worries. Himmers excels in this area due to its light weight, making it easily transportable. It can even be deployed from C-130 and larger aircraft, allowing for quick and decisive action in often inaccessible and harsh environments. For these reasons, the U.S. can combine artillery firepower in key regional positions around the world with multiple global partners that operate HIMARS and MLRS launchers. Currently, the U.S. armed forces are collaborating to define and implement Joint All-Domain Operations, JATO, a concept that involves connecting multiple assets across air, land, and sea to form a more unified force. The JATO concept is essential to protecting the U.S. and its allies, with Lockheed Martin supports all-domain efforts by providing tools and participating in joint exercises, and Himmers comes a great example for this. Himmers has been tested in several joint military exercises, such as Valiant Shield and Northern Edge, where it has proven to be highly effective and reliable. It also played a role in the U.S. Army's Project Convergence, when the PRSM launched in a side-by-side -side demonstration at White Sands Missile Range in New Mexico in 2021. More interestingly, Himmers has earned its reputation for combat reliability with over 1.9 million operating hours. It means that the Himmers fleet has logged over 200 years of operating hours. This makes Himmers extremely cost-effective solution for the land forces. Two years ago, Lockheed Martin celebrated a milestone when the 500th Himmers arrived in Romania for delivery to their global partner, and the U.S. Army awarded them another contract to build launchers for the U.S. Marine Corps and an international customer. Overall, Himmers' dependability is unquestionable, and its modular platform, which can support future pod variants, ensures that it will be around for a long time. It is believed that the Himmers launchers with longer ranges will enable the Army to attack enemy forces further behind the front lines. That's all for today. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.